going on everybody it's Damien from the Forbidden Fruit um, I want to do a review on the Smith tree from just fruits and exotic uh, this tree is four years old and this is the first season is produced it took a few seasons to put on a lot of growth and finally I got growth this year and um, this is really a first time sampling this tree and this fig and it is amazing I mean I'm picking figs off of this thing it's late August. There was no head start given to this tree. It's in a pot and this thing has been, it is almost every fig is dripping honey. I mean, look at the, the handful of figs I have here all just oozing on honey out of the eyes and they are delicious. Um, here's another one. I mean, this tree is just pumping them. Um, but what's really nice is that here in the East Coast, you know, you can grow this tree in a pot, not give it a head start, and still get figs in August. And it produces abundantly once it starts actually producing figs. Um, I almost gave up on this tree just because it was getting big and I wasn't getting anything off of it. And I was going to give it, you know, one more year. And here it is. Puppies producing. Um, anyways, that's my review on it. East Coast 6B, 7A. I would recommend growing this tree in a pot and possibly in ground, which I'm gonna go take the next step.